automatically when this guy shows up. I'm worried if my suit is going to be in the same condition it was. Oh, when you're I looking good. I'm always yeah. clean. I always, always walk, I always walk away clean, but now we're doing tie dye. Oh, so. now you challenged me. Uh, <laughs> so, the, hey, uh, so, so with the holidays right around the corner, yeah. I think it's kind of fun sometimes to have something that's special. So when you make it for somebody, wouldn't it be nice to have kind of a one of a kind piece? Very cool. The shirt is cool, and so yeah. I got to show you this little technique that's really, really kind of cool. And tie dye is always popular. Tie dye is fun, but it's, a, it, but it's a different kind of tie dye. So okay. let me show you the first piece, and they've got everything, all the materials for all you right. to try as well. So take a look at this. We're going to start with just a regular cotton shirt. So mm -hmm. it's really important that it's a cotton shirt. I like to wash it first to get all the sizing out. Okay. Inside that, I'm going to take one of these uh, red cups, the red solo cups, and put those, uh, put that one in there like that, and I'll stretch the rubber band around it all so right. it kind of holds it in place. Yeah. Fair enough? Yep. So now we're going to ruin the shirt because <laughs> yes. you're going to use your Sharpie pen. So why don't you do the same here? Just stretch your rubber band around the cups. Oh, so okay. just kind of, there it is. All you're trying to do is kind of hold it in place. Okay. Good job. Mm -hmm. yep. Got yours ready to go. Now, uh, your Sharpie pens, now, Sharpie uh, is permanent. Right? Yes, it is. Yes, yes it is. As many parents <laughs> know. So, that. so we're ruining the shirt, which is really kind of a cool thing. So here's what I want you to do: open up the sharpie pen, and we're going to keep the design pretty tight in the middle here. I'm going to do just little circles. So a couple little circles. Think of a quarter, and just kind of design it in the middle of a quarter. So just kind of, yeah, really tight. That's good. And maybe a couple more over here, like color. this, different color over here, and it could be a line if you wanted to. I'll turn it so the camera can see. So just kind of tip it like this so the camera okay. can see. See, I'm just doing a little design here. It doesn't really matter. Um, you're going to see there's going to be a little bit more art to it later on because uh, colors that are sitting next to each other will blend, which is kind of okay. cool. Uh, I think it was in that book, um, uh, Super Indelible, Never Come Off Till You're Dead, Maybe Longer Coloring Marker, right? And okay. so that's what they call a Sharpie. Okay. Uh, now, if you try to drip water on this or wash it, it's not going to come out because this ink does not dissolve with water. However, if you take a look at this right here, Rubbing alcohol, ah. that is the secret right huh. there. So there's your rubbing alcohol. Cheap and convenient. Mm -hmm. Now, you, uh, Super if cheap. you take a look at it, 70% is not bad. 90% really is fantastic. Better. So I think that's 91%. Less water is better, but you can do either one. And what we're doing here, kind of uh, to help us out, is I've got these little dropper bottles for you. I see oh, that. So yeah. I went to uh, to the store and just found these little bottles that will deliver one drop at cool. a time. What I want you to do is this. Take a look at this one here. I can't tip it for the camera, uh -huh. but I'm going to drip in the very middle of the design. I'm not going to flood the whole hey. shirt. But Take a look at this. Just I'm just going to drip middle. in the very middle of the design, and I want you to watch what happens. Oh, it's oh, look at that. grabs the ink, and it starts to spread it out, oh and then goodness. you stop. Here, try yours. Oh, so good. right there in the very middle, as you just drip, 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 and it will start to spread the ink. Now, the rubbing alcohol gets a hold of that ink, and it carries the ink along the fibers, and so you see it just starting to spread out, and then you can stop because it's going to keep on spreading. So you can kind of see yours as it's spreading. Yeah. So if we tip them down a little bit, you can kind of take a look at what those look like. You blow on it. You have to do this in a well-ventilated area, otherwise the kids leave a lot happier than how they started. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we got it? Noted. So the, it, there it is. When, you are, when you're done with this, like I wouldn't do it just yet. Uh, you move it to another one. So here I started okay. another one for you. I'm so try to another do design better, sits oh, here. Oh, okay. And now do another. another. Okay. Absolutely. So, so you let that one dry while you work you on this. You kind of let that one dry as you're working on this one. Remember, you're on the inside of the shirt, and it really is a cool kind of chemistry thing with solubility of inks. So if I, it's a good little trick to know that if you want Sharpie pen to go uh, come off, rubbing alcohol will help you kind of do that. Now when you're all done with it, I'm going to show you what the final product looks like. But you're gonna, um, you're gonna. A heat set it in the dryer so that's going to be perfect so a little heat set there is great here let me accent it with some yellow all the way around here like that you're gonna get pretty creative with those designs again if you drip in the very middle there you allow the colors to mix which is kind of cool Kim if you'll hand me those finished shirts yeah. I'm gonna show you what people are going to get take one of them and I'll give one to Ryan as well so here take a look at this oh, one here show this and one I gotta here tell use you, that one like here I said, and I'll grab I that one look at these the look at kits, that and the kits are messy this the kits is are awesome. kind of this messy. isn't messy at all isn't the kids that Love this, this is so much fun and artistic. Yes. Yeah. So it really is pretty. I had a teacher do this one for me here. Look at the little fish that are sitting here on this one. Is that good? Oh, that fun? one's very cool. And on Facebook, uh, we're going to post some other ideas and some other designs and some things you can do on it as well. So later on tonight, facebook.com slash Steve Spangler. But of course, they'll have it on Nine News as well. Thanks, we Steve. We love it. That was fine, and we didn't make a mess. No. We'll be right back.